Hey everybody and welcome to another video. So in this video it's going to also be a collab. Before I start the actual video, I'm going to be collabing with Muslim Vlogger. He posts a lot of inspirational and great videos which I actually have been liking for the past few days and um, it's actually really good because I can relate to a lot of the things he says. And recently he's made a video where his post got removed where he was trying to share happiness about someone losing weight and I think that's really disrespectful and I really appreciate if y'all, you know, sent him some love, you know, checked out his channel and possibly subscribed. So let's get into the video! Yes! Biasism is basically where you take someone's side to be unfair with the other person and usually it's because of the fact that you know the one person more than the other and you think that that person in your mind deserves more respect because of the fact that you know them or they're close to you and usually biased people don't really have very good moral values therefore i think biasism is not good although there are some times where it's actually acceptable whereas maybe your child has committed a crime or something or something where he's gone into a fight and the person maybe you know hit your son obviously you're gonna get mad over that that's biasism but that's acceptable because you have to understand that it's your child like how would you feel like if someone you know it's pretty much like you're taking someone else's thing and then destroying it so that's kind of biasism. It's technically biasism, but it's not if you think about it. Now, the reason why I think you shouldn't be biased in general and be neutral is because of the fact that it shows that you have an open mind. You're an open-minded person. You are able to see things from different perspectives, which shows that you can adapt to new things and you're going to be able to actually understand people better and you'll be able to get some more knowledge than most biased people. If you're biased then a lot of people are eventually going to point that out towards you and that's just going to cause drama and and we don't really want drama we want to make sure that everyone gets along and make sure that we can all somewhat have a reasonable discussion instead of having a complete fuss which has nothing to do with anything. Anger is usually where someone has mistreated you or done something which you don't agree on or something which basically just pisses you off. Being angry is sometimes okay I guess, but the fact that you can be angry and do all these things which maybe probably break the law is just, it's not necessary. I don't think it's necessary that when you're angry you can use that as an excuse to break people's um, precious things and you know just destroy everything because that's doesn't that's not a good excuse and i'm i understand there are some people who have anger issues and people sometimes just can't help themselves but that's where medical and doctor people are the outcome of having anger issues is that you won't be able to take things very literally or unliterally depending on how you are but you're gonna take things the wrong way and you're gonna take things the way you think they're supposed to be taken and sometimes they're not even meant to be taken that way this is also gonna start getting your brain really destroyed inside and making you think about bad thoughts and you want to have good thoughts because if you don't have good thoughts then you know what's the point of living if you're just gonna be you know unhappy 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 you need to make the correct choices and choose happiness Happiness is where someone makes you happy because of something you like or something you think makes you warm inside. And this could be where someone gives you a present, someone does something which you wouldn't expect, you know, anything which basically makes you happy. We all have different likings, so, so something which makes me happy maybe doesn't make you happy and vice versa. And trust me, there's a lot of people on the internet who try to eliminate this happiness. And there's quite a couple of reasons. For one, entertainment could be negativity. 
as much as hard as that sounds but negativity is usually entertainment for example people talking about natural people disasters. talking about arguments and all of that and i guess it's just a human thing and you know i i'm not surprised that people like negativity because of the fact that usually when it comes to negativity it comes to natural disasters or things which wouldn't usually happen so when it when those negative things which don't usually happen and they come up to you then you're like <gasps> so comparing that to how much good is actually done in this world isn't quite equal and the reason why most people don't try to like preach happiness or anything is usually because they just don't want to be in quote unquote drama and it's kind of stupid because you don't really Everyone's losing off this, so it's not really necessary. If you see a situation or time where you can give in yourself just to make someone else happy, I think that's something you should look up to. This is probably the most important part of this video. How do you stay happy? There's a lot of ways to be happy, but one of the most important ways to stay happy is to occupy yourself with something you love because if you keep doing something you don't like then chances are you're gonna feel upset, depressed possibly and it's just not gonna make you happy. Do something you love and do something which you think will benefit you in a stronger and moral way because in the long term you're gonna look back and see that you made the great decision to do the thing you love even if people don't agree with you. And the outcome of being happy is, you know, typically that you will be able to live a proper life without having any problems as less, you'll still have problems possibly, but you will have much less problems. And life is usually, you know how a lot of people say life is about having problems, but I really think that it's more about you solving them rather than you actually just having them. So happiness can be the key to success, your success. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate you watching for this video. Make sure to check out Muslim Vlogger because I think he's a really good YouTuber and I think he deserves the support. He deserves more support than what he's getting. And I really appreciate if you did go and check him out and I'll be linking him in the description and on screen right now. So it should be on this side. And yeah, so if you did enjoy this video, share it do all your social media things my name is mamza and i'll see you guys later peace bye